have learnt in detail about the different kinds of tenses. And you know by now that tense is about time. So there are three main kinds of tenses. The present tense, the past tense and the future tense. So a verb that refers to an action or state in the present is in the present tense. You have learnt in great detail about the different kinds of present tenses. Let us quickly revise them today. You know that present tenses are of four kinds. The simple present tense, the present continuous tense, the present perfect tense and the present perfect continuous tense. I paint landscapes. This is a general statement or a fact and so it is in the simple present tense. The verb is either the base verb or the singular form of the base verb in this tense. In the present continuous tense, I will say, I am painting a landscape now. So it is showing an action which is in progress at the present moment or now. In the present continuous tense, the verb is formed using am, are or is depending upon the subject and the ing form of the base verb. In the present perfect tense, we would say, I have painted a landscape just now. And the verb is formed using has or have with the past participle form of the base verb. In this case, the base verb is paint and the past participle form is painted. In the present perfect continuous tense, we would say, I have been painting a landscape the whole afternoon. You can see here that the clock is telling us that he has painted the landscape the entire afternoon. The verb form in the present perfect continuous is has or have with been and then the ing form of the base verb. So we have four kinds of the present tense where in the simple present our verb is paint, in the present continuous our verb is am painting, in the present perfect our verb is have painted and in the present perfect continuous our verb is have been painting. Let us compare the verb forms in all the four tenses. In the simple present tense, it is base verb or the singular form of the base verb. In the present continuous, we use am or are or is with the ing form of the base verb. In the present perfect, we use has or have with the past participle form of the base verb. And in the present perfect continuous, we use has or have with been and then the ing form of the base verb. You will notice that the ing form of the base verb tells us that an action is in progress or is continuous. In the present perfect, we use has or have which is common in the present perfect continuous also because the present perfect continuous is formed from the present perfect and the present continuous. So in the present perfect continuous, we use has or have, which is also there in the present perfect and the ing form, which is common to the present continuous to show that an action is in progress. Now, if you want to revise the differences between some confusing present tenses, let us do that. I paint landscapes is in the simple present tense, which is telling us a general statement or a fact. But when we say, I have painted a landscape just now, it is in the present perfect tense. And what does it show? It shows that an action began in the past 
was completed in the past and it has an effect in the present. So when we say I have painted a landscape just now, we are referring to an action which has just been completed. So it has an effect in the present. If we say I am painting a landscape now and I have been painting a landscape the whole afternoon, what is the difference? I am painting a landscape now, I am painting is in the present continuous tense and it is showing us that an action is in progress now at the present moment. Whereas have been painting is in the present perfect continuous tense and it is showing us that an action has started in the past continued for a period of time. What is the period of time here? The whole afternoon and is in progress now. You can see he is still painting. If we say I have painted a landscape just now, have painted is in the present perfect tense and have been painting is in the present perfect continuous tense. What is the difference between these two tenses? The present perfect tense shows that an action has started and completed in the past but it has an effect in the present. Whereas in the present perfect continuous tense we see that an action has started in the past, continued for a period of time and is in progress now. By now, I think the different kinds of present tenses must be extremely clear to you. So let us do some exercises. Identify the tense of the following sentence. He is solving a crossword puzzle. Let us identify the verb first. And this has the form is and the ing form of the base verb. What is the base verb here? Solve. So this sentence is in the present continuous tense. Identify the tense of the following sentence. She has already received her driver's license. Let us identify the verb first. Has received already is specifying the time. So has received is formed by using has with the past participle form of the base verb. What is the base verb here? Receive. So what tense is this sentence in? The present perfect tense. Fill in the blanks with the correct forms of the given verbs. Now don't get nervous seeing this big paragraph. It is really quite simple. Let us read it first. Jones is a mechanic. He Dash, in the bracket, we have the verb work. In the garage for the last three years. In this job, he also, dash, in the bracket, we have the verb drive, around to help the customers. Right now, he, dash, in the bracket, drive to the city outskirts for a car breakdown. Let us take one sentence at a time and try to fill in the blank. Jones is a mechanic. He dash in the garage for the last three years. Now this sentence is telling us about a duration or a period of time for which he has been working in the garage for the last three years. So this sentence is telling us a duration of time for which he is working in the garage. So what will be our verb form here? 
has been working in this job he also dash around to help the customers this is something that he regularly does so what will be the verb form here in this job he also drives around to help the customers right now he what will be the verb form here it is something that is showing an action in progress now so it will be is driving to the city outskirts for a car breakdown so our paragraph will be jones is a mechanic he has been working in the garage for the last 3 years in this job he also drives around to help the customers right now he is driving to the city outskirts for a car breakdown i hope the present tense is absolutely clear to you by now and i hope you are using it in your everyday writing and in your speech with your friends so the simple present tense shows an action that happens regularly general statements instructions or universal truths the present continuous tense shows an action or state that is in progress at present or now the present perfect tense shows an action that has been completed in the past but has an impact in the present it also shows an action that has started in the past and may have continued till now the present perfect continuous tense shows an action that has started in the past has continued for a period of time and is in progress now at the present it also shows an action that has started in the past and has continued regularly up to the present so i hope by now the different kinds of the present tenses must be absolutely clear to you and i hope that you are using these different kinds in your regular writing and in your speech with your friends don't forget to subscribe to our channel you can also register for free at deltastep.com or download the delta step app to get all learning resources as per icsc cbsc ib cambridge or any other curriculum over 5000 amazing lectures across maths science english and social science our unique interactive video technology keeps you engaged and our i dictionary feature allows you to quickly revise any concept master each topic at your own pace with our adaptive practice technology and 1 million plus questions get instant answers and detailed solutions be exam ready by taking unlimited mock tests performance analysis with actionable feedback personal tutors to resolve your slightest of doubts that's not all you can also win amazing prizes like playstation ipad watches and many more along with certificates through our earn as you learn program so learning at delta step is not just fun and easy it is also rewarding so register for free now